hello how are you doing happy krishnashtami across the globe you know that krishnashtami is being celebrated all over the world despite the dangerous and deadly pandemic coronavirus okay let's come to the lesson so far we have been discussing certain verbs which are not usually used in the progressive form let's let us discuss the list number 4 now have a look at the black board white board verbs of possession list 4 these are called verbs of possession because all these verbs are used in the sense of possession now have a look at the board have possess o o belong to consist of comprise contain okay now let us discuss the use of have have is generally mostly used as the verb of possession for example i say i have got a wife but lord krishna had eight wives so i am called a monogamist whereas lord krishna is called polygamist monogamist means a, a woman or man who has only one life partner throughout the life of course lord krishna is an incarnation of god or god himself but i am not okay now let us know how have can be used in other senses also in fact native speaker usually say have got instead of have especially the british usually say i have got something for example i say i have got two daughters of course they got married i have got a house i have got two motorcycles in this way whenever you want a thing you can say i have or i have got okay i think you have understood how to use have in the sense of possession but have cannot be cannot be used in other sense when it is not used in the meaning of possession for example you can't say that i am having two daughters because here have is used in the sense of possession but you can say i am having a bath or i am having a lunch in fact we are all having very bad times because of the dreadful corona virus here we are having means we are not possessing them but we are experiencing them so we can say we are having similarly you can say i am having a bath i am having a lunch i am having lunch i am having dinner i am having breakfast of course you can say i have breakfast in the morning when you talk about your present habit now let us come to another word possess possess is also equal to how but it is more formal of course i can say i possess two daughters but that is more formal than i have two daughters or i have got two daughters okay now another word own own is almost equal to have suppose i can say i own this house yes because this house belongs to me this is my house this house is mine okay own means belong to i have already told you how to use belong to this house belongs to me or this book belongs to me or this file belongs to me okay now consist of generally people confuse with the use of consist of and comprise 
consist always followed by of but comprise is never followed by of comprise means consist of so you should say my house consists of six rooms yes and of course my house really consists of six rooms five on the ground floor one on the first floor otherwise i can say my house comprises six rooms but i shouldn't say my house comprises of most educated non native speakers usually say comprises of that is wrong you should not use it on any circumstances especially in the competitive examinations okay now contain contain is also used in the sense of possession i can say my file contains important documents you must know that all these verbs cannot be used in the progressive forms when they are used in the sense of possessiveness for example i can't say i am having two daughters i am i cannot say i am possessing a lot of wealth i can't say i am owning a house but here own own means i owe you a lot because you have been listening to my lessons you have been liking them and in fact you are subscri subscribing to them i'm very happy to announce that i have got 106 subscribers right now okay i started using this channel a month ago in this month the subscribers have increased to 106 i'm really grateful to all of you because it is you who have to encourage me you have to like my lessons you have to subscribe to my channels otherwise there is no use of teaching all these lessons only okay i think you have got the point i am repeating again all these verbs can be used in the in forms when they are not used in the sense of possession but they shouldn't or must not be used in the progressive forms when they are used in the sense of possession and with this i would like to take leave of you and also i am reminding you that please don't sub forget to subscribe to my channel because you have to do me you have to do me a small favor by subscribing to my lessons if you subscribe to them i will be very happy and i will be preparing my lessons with more interest and more utility and more happiness okay i am taking leave of you and i am also wishing you all success as today is happy christmas to me this is jvl nasim harao signing off for today and i will be meeting you tomorrow bye